the hype is here the hype is now we have uh, the next game for OEPL easy versus tricking um, tricking wasn't I think it wasn't the Tigers they were in SPL finals uh, they, they won SPL Whew. I think I love the explain later too yeah I will be right back with the game and pause it real quick okay here we are you see easy bring this Ooh. Did he steal this team from some guy on the ladder? I've seen this guy on the ladder and Easy asked for the team. Someone used this team on the ladder. Oh yeah, Easy's recorder's team name. Oh wow, Tricking brings some 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 spicy team. Good God, Mega Pidgeot. Yeah, Pardon. Um, what does a Pardon do for his team? Check Zodex. Cannot get like status because he has the Fini support. Oh yeah, I can see the Fini support. I don't know if that's um There's this one stall breaker Cartana said with vacuum vacuum wave and bloom doom. I don't think he's that set though. I think he's Z move Manaphy or Z move Magina, but Manaphy's more likely. So looking at Easy's team, right? The Kalyu should probably be the Scarfa. Mega Mana was still allowed in this, so that's also obviously why he has a hippo for Metagross, yeah, Zodex, like I said, what else? Yeah, League is also an easy team, he's playing later, like I said, it's gonna be hype. To be honest, I'm thinking the Magina has a salt vest. The Pidgeot might be HP ground, because he doesn't he doesn't have a doggy to get rid of Heatron. Okay, leads off with Mega Metagross. Seagraph doesn't kill from full, so I assume he's gonna see a U-turn here. Exactly, he gets a crit turn one. That doesn't do much. And we're gonna see Mash, Ice Punch, something like that. Mash. And yeah, hip Helmet Hip Powered on, like, there's no point for Easy in staying in. Like, Metagross only beats Hippo if it gets a Medium Mash boost. Like, if it got the boost there, yeah, it would've been so bad for tricking. Like, Ice Punch would've killed afterwards. But yeah, Easy's gonna go into, like, Tangros, Kelio. Something like that. And Tricking's gonna slag off or go for rocks, but he has to slag off, yeah. The kid goes Lando. So Lando's obviously his rocker if it's not Metagross, yeah. I assume we can, yeah, I was about to say, we're gonna see a Toxic. I hate it when they make the play and I predict the play correct, but I'm too late. And they already made the play. So this is Z-Move Lando, potentially. There is a Continental Crush, I think. SD stealth or EQ Stone Edge, SD Stone Edge. I mean, the Magina can also be leftovers, but they haven't tricked team, but I think it's AV. So is he gonna go? Okay, he's gonna go Magina predicting. Oh, is it, is it Supersonic Sky Star? It is Supersonic Sky Star. That did so much. I predicted that Z move wrong, good god. I'm not good at predicting Z moves today. Earlier in Pad Ops came out, it said. I said it was the Sky Strike and it was the Crush, and now it's the other way around. Okay, picks of the Megina. This land is gonna be like 50 ish, 41, okay. You can go to Manaphy here, or you can go to um, Kartana? Kartana? But yeah, he's already got a kill, not looking bad for my guy. Yeah, he's in the Skype chat. Um, no Skype group. So I'm rooting for him. Okay, he decides to go Pidgeot. I don't know if I would have, like, he takes rocks, so I don't know. I might have gone to Manaphy, but it's fine. Like, Easy doesn't have the best answers for this. He has a Magina, which is like his best check to it. Because Metagross would die to Hurricane Plus Heatwave for sure. No Guard Hurricane is pretty cool, but is it? Uh, I'm thinking if this might be the work up PG with that. Uh, now he already revealed that he's U turn, he's not the work up set. U turn runs like Heatwave, Hurricane, and HP Grounder Roost. Yeah, okay, so if he just stays in, I thought he might have gone hard, Megina. I think he's not a Salvest Megina. If he's AV, he might have gone hard, Megina. I think he's like Trick Room or Shift Gear. 
but we shall see you turn out into what Hippodon, but Hippodon is gonna get blown away by Floor Cannon. Ooh, on the Volt Switch, so I think it's AVV has a Volt Switch. Unless he's Trick Room Volt Switch, but Trick Room doesn't make much sense on his team now that I look at it. He doesn't have a Murrack or something that can abuse Trick Room, he only has Medina. And Volt Switch is like. Most of the time it's AV if they're in Volt Switch. Like. Ooh, Ice Beam did so much. Yeah, okay, McGinnon actually outspeeds it, but I wasn't sure for a second. You can go for Florcan here. If he has that, or... But I assume tricking is just gonna sack his hippo. Like, there's no point for tricking in this team switching out exactly. Because he can just revenge this McGinnon with... Manaphy or Katana. Okay, he goes Pidgeot again. He just refuses to make the play that I suggest. I guess I'm bad. <laughs> yeah, he do have killed this. Even if it's heavy, it's at 23 or 22. Shodan runs down sometimes. Dang, there's a UU. I think it's UUPL match. Roses versus Selgor. I don't know if that's UUPL, but some UUPLs today. I'd love to record that too, but yeah, let's focus on the game. So he's gonna sack the Megina, I assume, or... Like, I don't think there's a point in going hard into something like Zygarde. Scarf Kelly looking like... Kind of good for easy light game. Okay, he makes the hard Zygarde play, okay. So if it's Bandit, E-Speed kills. I assume he's gonna go hard Fini, yeah. Oh, this is actually huge for Easy, because if the Fini dies, what does he have for Keldeo then? I was just about to say, like, Keldeo looks pretty good if he can weaken the Fini, but the Fini is gone now. So Keldeo looks really good. Spamming Secret Sword now, like, no resist. Okay, okay, that's a potential win come for Easy. I think he can win this. So. I like, I don't wanna say he has it in the bag. That did, that did nothing. Oh, he's fifth death tangles. That's why it did nothing. So he's preparing for Metagross. I see his, I see his team. It's pretty cool. Like defensive tangles and the AV with Megina for this, to take the special hits. A nice defensive core here with the Volt Switch to bring in the Bandit Zygarde. Get the tangles with the sleep power to support the team with the knockoff. Got a nice. Um, Zyga to take hits from Volcarona if it's not HP Ice, get the nice scuff kill to revenge Volcarona too, so he's not weak to that. In that sense. Get a nice Z move Rocks Lando. To get Rockstar vs. Stall, amazing. This team's cool, who made this? Okay, so he I don't know why he went Magina there, but it's Comet Manaphy. What did he predict going to Magina? So is it is it call mine Z rain dance? Oh, it's leftovers. It's already good that it's leftovers. So Z move is e probably on Kartana then probably Z fighting. Mm -hmm. Thunder punch from Metagross probably doesn't kill because it's if it's max defense Manaphy or like near max defense. I think Zygarde is an option here. Like, if it outspeeds, I don't know if how much speed he runs runs on the mana fee. But yeah, he decides to go Keldeon. We'll click Secret Sword here. It showed like I don't think it two kills. Yeah, I think ooh, no, now he gets a rest off. Ooh, I think he should have gone. Mm. Either to Metagross or to Zygarde, but I'm not 100% sure. Like, Metagross would have done a lot of damage with Thunder Punch. And he had the Kartana in check with the Tangros. And Scarf Keldy was like. can still revenge kill the Pidgeot. Like, Pidgeot is low after Rocks, like, super low. 
Like, if he doesn't have BP on Metagross, Pidgeot kills it anyway with Heatwave, I think. With 62. I don't know. Like, I don't see how... Maybe I'm wrong here, you guys can correct me. But I don't think he needs the Metagross for anything else. When he has the Tangos for a Katana. And he has a sack in Megiana when Pidgeot comes out. And then he can go into Scarf Keldeo after sacking the Megiana. And click Secret Sword on the Pidgeot. And that would be good, but now he's just gonna go for rest here. Because I've used this Manaphy in, in, in Auras a lot. I know this, this set is cool. Dang. This Manaphy sets up all over the Keldeo, so this is bad. I don't know if Easy Choke was... Like this... This mana is pretty bulky, so I, I don't think it should outspeed um, a Bandit Zygarde. Or maybe it, maybe it outspeeds a Bandit Zygarde. Okay, we will find out now. Now he makes the play that I was thinking that he would, might have made earlier. Like, Metagross obviously would have sped the, ma the, the mana field. Yeah, see, the Zygarde is faster, so that's what I was thinking earlier. But yeah, now it should be in Thunder Punch range. It's at uh, 53 after the Outrage. So I think Easy still wins. Oh, it, it doesn't kill or gets the para. But it doesn't get the full para. Oh, he lives on one or gets the burn. Come on. Para and burn on the same turn. But yeah, I think Easy, Easy still wins this. Whew. Dang, that was... That was... Whew. So he lost for a second. Uh, Kartana is pretty good fist death, but I think this should kill. But Easy will run the Kalk. And if he doesn't want to risk it, he just goes in the tank with that. That's a pretty safe play, but this might get blown away by a plus two Z move. But I don't know if Z move. I think Z moves don't. You don't get take Rocky Home of damage if you go for Z move. I think. Like if he gets hammered on this, this is in range from Kelly for sure. Dang, I kind of. I'm kind of curious. I want to run the cult now, but I don't want to miss any turns alive. Like. I assume Secret Sword is a roll on Katana, that's why he switched out. Oh, he's expecting this Katana to have some bulky beats, I don't know. Um, uh, the tank with its max defense might actually live a plus to all pummeling, but... I'm not sure, because Katana is super strong. But yeah, all pummeling is not stabbed. Second Sword did 15%, so plus 2 it would do 30%, but then you have to add it in that it's a Z move, so it would do like maybe 70 or 80. I don't think it would kill. I don't think it would kill at all. Yeah, so I think Easy wins. He can, he can just go for HP Fire here. I mean, he can go Hard Pidgeot here if he breaks HP Fire, but that doesn't do anything for tricking. Because then Easy just sacks the Megina and Kelly comes back and gets a kill or basically just wins. Like, after another rock switching, I'm pretty sure this would be in range. Or, I don't know. There, there has to be some reason why he switched out. Yeah, this dies to HP Fire. He has to bank on this not having HP Fire. Yeah, I, I get tricking to play. He had to bank on this not having it. Like, like I knew I knew uh, plus 2 didn't kill even with Z move. So, yeah, nice. Easy picked up a win. Thank the lord, I thought he lost for a second. But tricking this team is cool, dude. I like it. But he didn't say GG, what the fuck? He's just like, oh, what? I won! I didn't realize it. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Oh, I love Lee just asked for roses if they want to play. Yeah, so I will try to record that too. What, what do I have here? So Easy one for his team. Tony one was Ample. Chill Shadow one was Googly. TDK one was Somalia. And then we have Soling one was Alexander. So Easy's team is up. They're doing pretty well. This is week one, by the way. Um, yeah, you guys should know this. Um, yeah, like I've uploaded another video earlier for OUPL. They are 4 and 1 at the moment, so that's pretty nice. They only have to win one more and then they have the week in the. They win the week. 
Hope you all enjoyed. This was a cool game, not gonna lie. Besides that one part, whew, that one part was weird. But I actually, I'm actually gonna run the Kalk for you guys now. Or just in general, I'm interested in the Kalk between uh, Scarf Kelly versus Katana. So yeah, the Kalk says it does, um, it does 84 to like to 100. So I think the Katana was at 72 percent when when he attacked it. So I'm not sure. Maybe he was um, maybe he was fearing Scarf Katana because he brought. Probably was feeling Scarf Katana. Which turn did he send out the Katana? After the man, if he died, right? Yeah, he sent out the Katana after the man, if he died. So the Kali was in, so he was scouting for Scarf. So yeah, I take back what I said there. That, that he made the correct play there, definitely. But before, like earlier, when the Manaphy revealed Carmine, um, I think he could have played a bit different. But yeah, I already mentioned that. Could have gone to Zygarde or Maragos first. Um, which turn was that? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, I'm talking about turn 17. So he vo he brought in the, the, the Medina and the Manaphy Carmine and the Volt switched out. So then basically the command was already revealed so it's pretty um I don't want to say obvious but it's like pretty common that it's a bulky defensive mana that has command so at that point he could have gone to Maragross and Zygarde but yeah I would have misplayed even way more so I'm not the guy to talk I'm just yeah uh, I think I caught that correctly Correct. I don't know how to say this. My English is bad, guys. Yeah, this was a cool match. I don't know why I'm dragging this out. And shoutouts to Evie for winning. Cool guy. And peace out, friends.